Hi guys, hello and welcome to another tutorial. This is Microsoft Office tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn about the new outline introduced in Office 365. So let me first draw a shape that you can draw from the drawing tool or you can go under the insert tab and you can actually find under shapes. It's the same stuff. So anyway, let me draw a shape right here around this area. Then let me go under shape fill, which is under shape format and choose no fill. Then let me go under shape outline and maybe pick a color. You must be familiar with all of these steps if you have used Microsoft PowerPoint or Microsoft Word. But what I'm getting next here is if you go under shape outline, you will find a new item called sketched. So what you can do now, before I choose sketch, let me increase the width so that you can actually see the sketch properly. So what sketch does, it allows you to have a little straighter line, which is none, or you can have the second effect or third effect, which is freehand, okay, or scribble effect. So you have different kinds of effects that you can use are curved, freehand and scribble. Those are the three effects that you can use. And it makes it look a little bit nice, like sketchy kind of an image, which basically adds a very nice effect. And it doesn't end here. You can actually go under shape outline and under sketched. You can actually go to more lines. What that does, it lets you even pick besides sketch line. You can actually choose compound as well. So you can have a compound line. Um, you can uh, basically choose different kinds of compound lines. Let me increase the width. So probably seven, just so that you could see it better. So as you can see that I've been able to choose different kinds of compounds. Also, I can uh, use dashes if I would like to use in the combination of compound, dashes, curved. So it, it really um, allows me to play around with a lot of these features and I can just create pretty much anything around these lines. So I just wanted to share this cool little thing with you that you can actually now have sketched lines for the outline of a shape. Catch you in the next tutorial. Till then, take care guys. Bye-bye.